Freedom Convoy leader Tamara Leach was arrested again on June 27 after a Canada-wide warrant was put out for her for alleged breach of court condition. Her arrest resulted in lots of reactions across the country and I wanted to get the reaction of Canadians who came to Ottawa for the arrival of veteran James Top and the celebrations of Canada Day, what they thought of Leach's arrest. What did you make of uh, Tamara Leach being arrested a second time? Well, I, I think it's totally political and it's, it's just Justin Trudeau's way of uh, putting pressure on people and trying to discourage us from standing up for freedom. And the crime that she was charged with is a misdemeanor. It should have been maybe some, uh, some probation, but what's happened to her now is terrible. I, I feel for her. I'm ashamed uh, of the people who are carrying out these orders. Uh, so uh, I, uh, I was very, very sad, and I, I, I lost some sleep that night when my daughter told me at se around 7 p.m. She said she's been arrested at Medicine Hat. I said, what? Uh, to me, she's, uh, she's a beacon of light and hope. I just feel that it's harassment. I do feel badly for her. Um, it's just harassment, more harassment. And uh, just have to pray, pray for her. The fact that they're wasting taxpayers' money on such a beautiful person who is only in Alberta singing her heart out, that they would make that effort just to jab us in the side. But we're strong, there's more of us together than we are alone you know and I just think yeah it was appalling it's very appalling everything that's happening is very appalling well to me it seems to be um, you know a bait tactic right trying to see if they can rile up some crowds to stir up some controversy here at uh, Canada Day so hopefully everyone just stays respectful you know and doesn't take the bait because that's what they want right to try to spin it uh, you know like say the mainstream media the Trudeau liberals, right? They want to spin it and use her as basically a political prisoner to bait people into doing something unsavory, right? Just to try to cause controversy so that's what they can capture on the news and try to spin it for uh, you know, their narrative. So hopefully everyone remains peaceful and hopefully she gets a fair you know, shot at the bail as well coming out. So basically it. <laughs> Do you have anything to add? Uh, if it wasn't a, a political example, it's, uh, as my husband just said, it was also just trying to set an example to us of look what can happen to you. Like, we'll throw you in here as well this weekend if you are disrespectful. So she's arrested for getting a picture taken with someone else who values freedom in Canada. So you can't get your picture taken. You're all a bunch of freaks out there and you know it because what you're doing is trying to vilify and demonize true freedom loving people. I know Tom Mazzaro, uh, I know Tamara Leach, and these people love Canada and love freedom, so it's really dumb. Now you've arrested her, almost like you were trying to stir up anger, almost like you were trying to make a problem when there didn't need to be a problem. So now we have political prisoners in Canada. I, what are we, China? Is the PM's love of China now turning into running our country like that? I don't know. As you saw, people are upset that she was arrested. For more coverage of the freedom movement, please visit tnc.news and consider supporting True North by making a donation. For True North, I'm Ili Campenatel.